got a new outfit earlier, didn't we? Priestess robe. Boots to faith. Huh. I want to do my hair like that. I'm going to one day. You saw it here first. I am getting that hairstyle one day. In the future. Um, let's have a look at our skills. I hmm, Military so low without it, though. But that's so high. But military... Military needs it more. Yes. That's high enough on its own for now. Outfit. Uniform. Oh, her hair's always been like that. Okay. What about... Was it like that? Like this? Oh, my word. Okay. Never mind. It's just more noticeable there. Okay. Good. Skills. That's so high, it's hard not to work on it. Okay, we're going to work on our composure. Oh, we were working on accounting, weren't we? But it's so low. Composure and meditation. Composure and meditation. For now. Just for now. Classes. Composure. Meditation. Done. You practice positive thinking, maintaining a good self-image and conditioning yourself to carry on rather than be frustrated by any past misstep. Yes, yes, good. You practice sitting calmly while your teacher circles around you and makes unexpected loud noises at random intervals. I'm going to survive this from now on. That's going to help me a lot. Increased by 19.05. You close your eyes and visualize the crystal ball floating in front of your eyes. You close your eyes and visualize a crystal ball floating through the air, moving past your eyes and into your mind, filling you with light. You learn to visualize the space around you so that you can see the whole room with your eyes closed. Nice. Increased by 24.98. I'm happy. There's a woman here to see you. She is a musician and wishes crown patronage. Which means money. Your Royal Highness, the magician says. Lol. Musician. Your Royal Highness, if you accept me as a member of your court, I will immortalize you in word and song. I have dabbled in musical styles from many countries and can entertain your guests and lighten your evenings. I'm not really accepting anyone at the moment because I want to make it to coronation. So can you come back when I'm queen? Oh, intrigue success. Success. Musicians are often used as secret agents and messengers. They can be useful and dangerous. The musician sings a little ditty to demonstrate her skills with the lute. She's actually pretty good. But she's probably a spy. Or I could use her as a spy. But she's probably already a spy and she's going to murder me. She's an assassin. Reject her. Thank you, but we are not interested. Good. Saved my life today. I think. Let us... What shall we do? Well, we haven't... We haven't ever snuck out. Why would we, though? such a dangerous time but we might as well because we haven't done it yet and it makes us willful which maybe we need what are we working on mm. let's do it let's sneak out you sneak out of the castle to have a little fun. You enjoy your freedom, but your father won't like it if he finds out. Well, we better not do anything that will get us found out. Can't believe she snuck out. What a naughty child. Mood. Okay, good. Fine. Let us now... I feel like our military is falling behind. But it's fine. That went down majorly. 
Okay. Can we work? Let's work on accounting. It's what we need to do. Accounting. I think that's all high enough for now. Let's work on accounting and what are we going to need soon? Accounting and maybe we should do some more animal handling. Let's do it. Let's do accounting and horses classes. Uh, economics, accounting, animal handling, horses. You study the manipulation of larger quantities through direct calculations using written numbers instead of an abacus. Good, good girl. You walk around the stables, meeting the royal horses, learning about their breeds and the names for different parts of their anatomy. Good, fine, 18.46 or something. You receive a letter from young Lord Adair. It's an extremely formal letter for such a little boy, thanking you for your wisdom and allowing him to live with his grandfather who probably dictated every word he wrote. But that's sweet. Uh, thank you, I, I appreciate that a lot. I I'm glad I made the right decision for once. Okay, let us, we want to sneak out again, not for a while. What should we do? Let's be more willful again. We haven't been willful for a while. Do you think we know enough? I don't think we do yet, not really. Don't wanna waste this. Um. Maybe we can. Okay, let's try. Visit the treasury. Oh, still failure. Fine. We need more accounting. Skills. Okay, well, obviously we need to study accounting. And... Accounting and horses again. Do the same thing. Done. You study money lending and the controversies involved in charging interest. According to the Druids, one should always return more than one is loaned, or else the debt gave no value to the world. 12.53 increase. You learn about caring for horses, grooming with different brushes, and keeping hooves free of stones. You learn about the different pieces that go into saddles and bridles, how to check for signs of wear, and how to equip and adjust them on a horse. Nice, 19.48 increase. It's doing good. Oh, fail. Staring up into the sky over your window, you notice a strange flash of light. Divination failed, but that's so high! I don't even understand why I waste my time. Should everything be at 100 by now or something? I don't even know. A falling star? Pretty. I've been studying this for so long and it didn't even like, oh, I don't even know. I don't even know. I don't even know. Fine, fine. I'm depressed. So let's go to, oh, no, no, we don't want to be depressed. We don't want to be depressed, but we are. <sighs> fine. Let's go and attend a service, shall we? Then peaceful ritual, calm our heart. We're not angry at our waste of time in studying divination. Yes, we are. What is wrong with you? Pressured. Okay. Skills. Do, do, do. You're going to study accounting. Ag so low. Why is that in the negatives? That angers me. We won't be studying it. Oh, that's plus three. We can't not study that. Okay. Not wasting my time with any more divination? Are we? No, let's study more law. Let's study more law. Because I'm um, when I. I don't know. Mm. Let's study divination then, because I'm not failing that again. So, divination and running. Divination and running classes. Divination and you will run in the evening. No, run in the morning. That's better. Agility. No. Athletics. Running. Faith. Divination. Done. You 
switch back and forth between a brisk walk and a light bouncing jog. Not too fast, you're building endurance rather than speed. Good, we will run for our lives one day. You learn about signs which sometimes appear in grounds or leaves at the bottom of a cup. You study the interpretation of dreams with warnings that dreams are easily forgotten, misremembered or warped by the thoughts and desires rather than true vision. You study the stars and learn about the omens they hold with warnings that the stars are seen by all and their portents may not be meant to you for you. Hmm. I see. So if I had had that before... Oh well. We'll never fail at that again. I have unpleasant news to report. Adair, the young lord of Elath, has been assassinated. What? He was shot with a crossbow while playing on the grounds of his grandfather's estate. How did this happen? Where were the guards? This is not the first time such events have happened within the realm of Esther. The Earl of Esther's first wife and oldest daughter also died under mysterious circumstances. That's so sad. Then his other daughter married young and died giving birth to Adair. With Adair dead, the only family he has left is his second wife and their son Connor, who's 15. I don't know enough. Just blame no one and hope it doesn't. If so many people have died in his family, it's suspicious, but maybe it's just sad coincidence, so blame no one. No matter what we do, things keep going wrong. It's like us, whatever I do, it goes wrong. We're just not having good luck. Then there is the matter of the Duchy of Elath, but she's still alive. By blood, the nearest living heir is Talaris to the Duke of Sedna in Talassi. But he's not even a Novan. One of his ancestors was. Elath is a major duchy. You cannot afford to lose control of it. And Talaris heir, uh, delay. I don't want to delay because it might go bad. We don't want to lose control of it. Name a Novan heir. As queen, I have the right to pass the lands of an extinct bloodline to a new ruler. Like my mother did with Uncle Laurent and Merva. Yeah, but now he wants to kill us. Talarist is only distantly related, and he's foreign. He doesn't count. Who should inherit the Duchy of Elath, then? Hmm. There are a few noble families with a lot of children. Too many to inherit all the existing titles. I say the Duchess of Lila has six children. The oldest three all have lands already. That's Kevin, the Earl of Lowe, Cursand, the Duchess of Mead, and Charmian, the Duchess Consort of Kegel. Oh, I don't remember enough about these people. Who was Kevin? I remember the name. I don't remember the person. Er. That leaves three... Oh, okay, fine. That leaves three others who are all a few years older than me. The Duke and Duchess of Kevel have seven children, three around my age and four younger. Including Linley, who I danced with at the ball. Well, he can have it then, hey? And they're all Arisay's grandchildren through their mother. So either way, it would be her line. Who did I dance with? Child of the... Who did I... I don't remember. Oh, darn it. Dun, dun, dun. Child of the Duke of Kegel, Lila, an administrator from Elath. Oh, a child of the Duchess of Lila. I believe that was the one I danced with, right? The Duchess of Lila has so many children. Let her pick one for Elath. Very well. Now that we finish studying, what will we do? We will 
visit the treasury. <sighs> Can't believe this is still not good enough. We will get in the treasury and get our jewel because it's rightfully ours. And I want to learn magic, so we will. Soon. <laughs> 